Happy New Year creatives, I'm back again and today I'm talking about my content strategy for quarter one 2022. So for the last couple months of 2021, I really had to take a hard look at um, my approach to the social media game. Um, and mostly because there were certain things that I realized I was spending a lot of time on that weren't generating a lot of return. Um, whereas um, other things were bearing more fruit, so to speak. So, um, and there's some new priorities taking place in 2022, especially as I go into full blown book launch mode. Um, I do have a goal. If you've been following me for a little, little bit, you know that I am planning on launching a book in September of this year, and uh, I'll be documenting that journey um, throughout quarter throughout this year, um, but especially in this first quarter, because a lot of activities um, will need to happen. And as I'm doing, you know, preparing for that launch, I'm going to be documenting and leveraging that into my content strategy for quarter one. Um, so I actually just to kind of illustrate what I'm doing, I actually created a uh, an Excel spreadsheet um, to kind of visualize what I'm doing for for each month. Um, so let's hop into that real quick. So I have here the spreadsheet that I will be using going forward uh, in building out my content strategy. So um, what I have here is every month is, is listed out here and then we have the days going um, horizontally. And so this first line is YouTube videos. The second line is Instagram. And I just broke down and got a TikTok um, not that long ago. And so I'll be um, adding in some TikTok videos that all kind of stem from the YouTube content. So just to kind of like reiterate it here. So I have YouTube will be my long form content and everything else will kind of stem from that. Um, and YouTube will mostly be documenting my creative journey at length. Um, and like I'm, I'm building a creative business. I'm building out, um, not just, not just this book launch. This book launch is one piece of a bigger vision that I have for the, the world that I've built within this story. I'm writing a script attached to it. Um, I have plans for, you know, merch and like what have you. Um, and like, there's going to be a lot of books within this series. So I, I need to think on a grander scale than just the book launch, but the book launch is, um, trying to, trying to send it off into the world with a bang. Um, so a lot of my YouTube content for quarter one will be around setting the ball in motion for that book launch. Um, and also like marketing tips, a lot of it will be like, um, you know, planning out content and building out those digital marketing plans and, you know, and talking to you guys kind of in a consultative nature. Like I, I just want to have a conversation about how to build a creative business because as I have seen, um, for creative entrepreneurs, it can be sometimes difficult to blend that business mindset with that creative energy. Um, and I, I'm just here to really help showcase how you can do both. You can be creative and have that energy that you want that um, kind of feeds your soul while also doing your best to lay the, lay the foundations to make it your livelihood. Um, that's what this channel will be largely about in 2022. Um, and then from that, um, I, um, my Instagram, will be focused on like extracting some of those some of those pieces from the, the youtube videos and um repurposing them into posts or videos i'll be leveraging video content a lot more in 2022 um and um i'll just be repurposing a lot of that content for different platforms i'll have to edit it a little bit differently to make it fit the, to make it fit the platform like the way i edit it the way I edit, you know, Instagram videos for posts or for reels will be very different than how I edit um, TikTok videos. 
um, but I will be using the same raw footage for that. And yeah, um, that's kind of my strategy going into it. Just kind of leveraging the fact that on the day to day and week to week, I have usable content and documenting that journey and providing um, boot creative business consulting tips and marketing tips and, and stuff like that as I go. Um, and then repurposing content to fit different platforms. Um, all with the intent of like building up to this very big, um, you know, and on all intents and purposes, a big business launch for me. Um, and while for me it's a book, for you it might be, you know, a course or it might be some other digital product that you have going on um, or even a physical product. Like some of the things that I'll be doing um, are very parallel to what you can do for other types of product launches. Um, so feel free to, you know, comment, ask questions. If there's something that, you know, you want to, for me to dive into more in depth, just let me know. I'm more than happy to do so. Um, and if you are looking, you know, for someone to be that sounding board that you need, you know, book a one-on-one -on -one with me. Uh, and I'm more than happy to be that sounding board to jumpstart your creative business. Um, but that is my quarter one 2022 content strategy in a nutshell. Um, what is yours? Like, let me know what your content strategy is for 2022. Um, I know I have, for me, it's kind of ambitious. I'm going to be posting about five times a week on YouTube. Um, it'll be short five minute videos. Um, just kind of giving you the, this this update from, in a little bit informal manner because I like eventually I'll probably get to something that's a little bit more produced but I really like the organic like I'm just sitting down talking with you kind of kind of content um let me know if there's you know anything that you want to see within the videos themselves more than happy to accommodate um you know if there's demand for it but yeah What's your content strategy like in 2022? And is, is there anything as I go into this book launch, as I go into these marketing plans and building out um, this creative business? Let me know if there's something specific that you have in mind that you want me to dive into. And with that said, until next time.